Freddy, where you at? Willie, where you at? I'm gonna tell you. Osteria Romana, 57,000 check-ins, amazing reviews, amazing write-ups on all type of media, newspapers, digital, old school, everything. Italian, you wanna go full-blown Italian tonight? Why not, hey? Let's do it, Osteria Romana. Where you at? Where you at? And what is this drink? This is a mojito that we make special here with fresh meal and lime. We use a special rum from the house and we squeeze it the bottom of the lime so it means with some sugar with some club soda and lime. We love it. Oh wow, it looks awesome. Salud. Salud. Hosteria Romana, the mojito. Outstanding. Wow. This is excellent. Thank you. Thank you, my man. So here we have uh, the, the homemade fettuccine pasta that we prepare with a cream porcini mushroom sauce. A porcini mushroom is a mushroom that comes from Italy, only grows in Rome. So it gets a very particular flavor. The mild very well with a truffle oil. So we toast it inside the parmesan or the wheel and it comes out like a, with a very particular flavor that you will love it when you try it. Let's see what we have with fettuccine sauce that I've, that I've heard so much about. Let's see what we got. The first thing I taste is the cheese. The cheese, out of control. That's what I taste right away is the cheese. Cheese all day. If you like cheese or you love cheese, this pasta with fettuccine sauce and cheese is the way to go. Delicious. Wow. 
That looks amazing. This is a bistec alla Fiorentina. Basically, it's a 25 ounces black Angus steak. We dry it here on the house, then we make it on the grill, we slice it, finish it up in the full burning oven. It melts in your mouth. It looks. You tell me later. I'll tell you. It and looks so, great. Thank you. Thank you. We're gonna find out what this melt in your mouth statement is all about. That's what he says. We're gonna hold him to it. Let's find out. You're not gonna believe this. What I tasted right away was like candy. It's so strange to say that. It tasted like candy initially when it entered my mouth. So there was an extreme sweetness to it. And then the meaty flavor sort of jumped in there. But it was very fruity. I've never tasted that in meat before. That is really interesting. Really delicious. So we have a tiramisu, it's a cream with pavetini and coffee. Real Italian dessert. Buon appetito. I think we got uh, the final piece of candy. The final piece of candy tonight. Tiramisu. Very common dessert, but it looks pretty good. And the folks here are Italian, so you can't ask for more. A very good term of Very good. And I'm gonna keep this as a memory of uh, Osteria Romana, right here. Very good. Osteria Romana. Did it live up to the hype? Most definitely. A 5.0 and 5 is the top. Let me explain something to you. The staff was amazing. The food was amazing. They actually do like a shows with, with the staff that makes you feel like you're in Italy itself. It was incredible. I mean, where else do you want to go if you want to eat Italian food? Nowhere else but. Osteria Romana. Come check it out. Where you at? Where you at?